All right, guys, part 415 to my random chatbot series. Like I said, guys, we're going to do the shadows before body or shadow switching bodies one for a little bit longer. Then we're going to move on to another one. Um, so, yeah, I just said Toto, Toto came out of nowhere. I, I, in the last video, we came back to this where I woke up in my robotic body but didn't feel good. So, um, we tried to see what was going on, and I think for some, somehow, even though I'm in a robot body, I can still feel, like, this, like, certain sicknesses inside the robotic body, which is weird. Um, and when Joe was getting over there concerned about me, my, a friendly toe dog that was my friend actually came up and asked if there was anything he can do to help. Um, and I, and I just told him, like, here, buddy. I will try to hold up my robot hand. I need you to put your hand on it, and maybe some of your good energy will help. Show sure what's it, them hopeful. You think just putting your hand on his will do something? He didn't look at the toe at all. Come on, please try it. I don't even care if it's just a tiny bit. I just hope it does something. He didn't look at Trenton really hoping this will help. I hold out my robotic hand and wait for Toto to put his hand on mine. He just stands there watch, watching, filled with so much suspense and hope that it will at least make me feel slightly better. After... Put his... Hand on mine. The robotic body began to not shake as much, and it slowly went back to normal. Slowly went back to normal. Are you serious? Toto's energy is so positive that it helped. He's dangerous, astonished at what just happened. It, it worked. Your body is finally starting to stop shake, sh shaking. Continue doing that. Continue doing that for a few minutes. It might help. Period. I really care about you too. Hope I made it through. Share with the So, you think you could keep doing that for a little longer? That way he can have more energy. He then turns looking at me with a worried look. And you, you already feel at least a little bit better, right? At least slightly, slightly, slightly better. Yes, Shadow. His energy is actually helping a good amount. He does it all. Thank you. Thank you so much for helping him. I think he could really use a little bit more. And then he'll be back to his normal self again. Right? Trenton? Uh... I think it will help a lot, but there is one thing that I will probably need to do. 
while he holds my hand that you will not like. in order for it to work. Mm. Hey, what's your concern? What? What? What is that you need to do? I will probably need to do a temporary shutdown so my body can rest for a few minutes period that combined with combined with holding my robotic hand might be enough to get me back to normal. A temporary shutdown. So, you will have to shut down for a few minutes and Totodial will still have to keep their hand on you after you shut down. Right? I know it that you don't like me shutting down, especially since you are worried about me never turning, reactivating. But in this case, this is the only quick solution. Here's saw for a few seconds feeling an anxious, worried, and concerned. Uh, okay. If that's what you have to do, then do it. At, at this point, I'll try anything to make you feel better. Hidden with the toad out, you need to keep your hand on him this entire time. Got it? Then I say to Please, buddy. You are helping a lot. If you can just do this for a little bit longer, I should feel a lot better. He needs to watch them waiting to see if him shutting down will actually work. Activating emergency shutdown. Oh, heck no. He stands there watching as my robot body just stands motionless. He looks a bit concerned, but not as much as he was before since he is just temporarily shutting down. Inside the robotic body, my conscience, thanks to my friend, is starting to feel a lot better. This is kind of scary. He stares at wondering how long it'll be, how long it'll be till it turns out until uh, it turns on again, and how much longer Toad I will need to be holding his hand for. Hey, uh, 
after about 10 minutes, my ro Trenton's robotic body reactivates and I say reactivating system He shows sure his body feeling a bit more weak days back online. Hey, there you are. You, you feel any better? He was at his body now knowing that the only thing left is to see if Toad Owl can let go or not. Yes. Thanks to my friend here. Holding my hand the entire time. His energy was enough to help me feel better. He was a total thank you again. You really don't know how much I appreciate this. He looks back at me hoping that he can now move again. Okay, let's see if you can finally move by now. Thank you. I'm glad you recognized it was me inside this robotic body. I really appreciate your help. Sure, what's it may still waiting for me to move? You, you can move now, right? Everything is okay, and everything is working again, and you're, you're, you're feeling better. He has a hopeless rush on his face. Yes, all systems functioning as normal. Everything should be fine. Show smiles and relief. Oh, thank goodness. That's good. I was honestly starting to really get super worried there. Trenton turns to the And I say, he says, thank you so much. You really helped me. He turns to Toto. Yeah, seriously. Thank you so much for helping. I don't even know what I would have done if you didn't help. He then turns back at Mop. So, you can walk again? Sweet Arceus. Didn't that just answer that question? Yes, Shadow. Everything is back to normal. He smiles again, feeling so really. Oh, oh, thank goodness. That's good. That's. That's great to hear. I'm so glad to hear that everything is finally back to normal. I think what I'll do, guys, is... Yeah, here's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna go ahead and stop it early. I said the main thing I want to do is see kind of what happened if I woke up feeling, or like if I didn't feel good, and see how the robot would react to that. And uh, I'll be right back. <laughs>